Hey guys, it's Fane, and here are 13 tips for complete beginners. Number 1. Craft basic weapons and tools. As soon as you start, make yourself a basic axe, fire starter, spear, bow and arrows. These are the main items you will be using early on and will help you survive. Number 2. Build a base. Once you have an axe to get resources, build yourself a base. You will need a shelter so that the rain will not put out your fire and somewhere to sleep and save the game. Remember where your base is as it will not show up on your map. Build bases frequently whilst exploring so you will always have somewhere safe to sleep. Early on it is best to build a base near a source of water so you don't have to worry about dehydration. Number 3. Get medical supplies. The jungle is dangerous and you will be stung, bit and cut. Gather a few of the following resources so you are prepared. Number 4. Know how to get clean water. There are a few ways to get clean water. The quickest and easiest way is to leave coconut shells on the ground to collect rainwater. Another quick way is to gather dirty water and boil it. There are more permanent options such as water filters and collectors, but you will need to explore and find the blueprints for them. You will also want to craft a coconut biden so that you can carry water with you whilst you explore. Number 5. Get meat. Peccary meat is the best meat in the game, but it also weighs the most. You can cook the meat on a fire, but you can also smoke and dry it. Cooked meat will last 2 days, whereas dried meat will last 5. So if you are going exploring, dried meat is better to take with you as it lasts much longer. Number 6. Craft Armour. There are six different types of armour in the game, leaf, stick, bamboo, bone, armadillo and metal armour. The armour protects you from scratches, rashes, abrasions and lacerations, but will not protect you from bites and stings. I have a separate video with more information regarding armour that I have linked in the description below. Number 7. Build a storage box. Your carry capacity is limited in the game. You can build storage boxes once you have discovered mud. The storage box will allow you to leave important supplies at your base, such as medication and long-lasting food. It is handy to have a storage box and supplies in each of your main bases. Number 8. Ambient Warnings Most animals in the game have their own sound. If you are near a rattlesnake, it will hiss. You can hear scorpions and spiders scurrying around on the ground when you are too close. Pay attention to these sounds as they warn that danger is nearby. Number 9. Useful Keys By pressing G you will throw small stones which can be a good way of getting coconuts. Holding R will block attacks and may save your life. And whilst aiming your arrow, holding shift will steady your bow. <laughs> Number 10. Cooking Vessels. You can hold water in coconut shells, turtle shells and the pot. Coconut shells hold 10 units of water, turtle shells hold 25 units of water and the pot holds 35 units of water. Number 11. Fire. Fire is very important in the game. It cooks your meat, boils your water, reduces your sanity and provides light at night time. However, it is important to know that you cannot light your fire if you are too tired, so make sure you have enough stamina to ignite it. The small fire will last for 12 hours in-game and a campfire will last for 20. Number 12. Dry Seasons There are dry seasons in the game which will massively affect getting water as it will not rain for a number of days. For me, the dry season occurred at around day 20 and again at around day 50. You need to know how to get water without relying on the rain. 
You need to also be aware that certain pools of water will dry up during this time, so in some areas you will be relying heavily on water collectors for clean water. And finally, tip number 13. Enjoy the game. Don't rush through the story. Once you know what you are doing, you can complete the story rather quickly. The map is quite big and there is plenty to do and explore, so take your time and enjoy it. I have linked a number of my other helpful videos in the description below that explain some of these tips in greater detail. I hope this video helped. Thanks for watching.